Healthcare is a big part of attracting new businesses and new people to an area. The panhandle continues to grow at a rapid pace, and Florida State University recognizes that. As News 13's Emily McLeod tells us, the state just gave the university several million dollars for its health and research facility on Panama City Beach. Florida State University President Richard McCullough says they want to perform cutting edge innovative research while also providing people in the panhandle better access to health care. Clinical research that you might do uh, helps to add to cutting edge research. You know, uh, if you're doing health data science and you're looking at, you know, radiation therapy and patient populations and you learn about um, you know, through data analysis, better ways to treat patients. McCullough also anticipates this facility will bring an economic boost along with it. These sort of research facilities uh, serve to fuel innovation. Uh, they fuel uh, partnerships with major companies. Uh, they help to for company attraction even, uh, the creation of new startup companies and all these things create jobs. The state legislature announced additional funding for several panhandle projects back in September. The FSU Health and Research Center received $2.8 million for the planning phase of the project. This planning grant really allows us to, to get started on thinking about, you know, what the facilities will look like, probably can help us, uh, you know, get some of the uh, projects off the ground. Florida State is partnering with Tallahassee Memorial Health and the St. Joe Company to bring this state-of-the-art facility to our area. In Bay County, Emily McLeod, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Officials estimate the entire campus, including the hospital, will be finished by 2027.